Welcome to Kutaisi. This is a city that during the USSR times was completely overrun with mafiosos. It got so bad that in the early to mid 2000s, the government essentially issued a warning, a very enforceable warning to all the mafiosos. Get the hell out of the country or spend the next 25 years in prison. And so all of them left going to the neighboring Caucasus countries and other post-Soviet states. Now, during the time that the Mafia was here, they operated very much like the Sicilian Mafia. They had their own hierarchy, they valued loyalty. Although, unlike the Sicilian Mafia, which had a more vertical, top to bottom hierarchy, where you had a boss, an underboss, soldiers, etc., the Kutaisi Mafia was much more loosely structured, and way more democratic, but there was still a clear progression in rank. Ganja, Azerbaijan. I think that's our next destination. Only 446 kilometers that way. There's probably no better town than Ganja in the entire Caucasus region. Gamarjoba. Говорите по-русски или по-английски? Русский. Что это такое? So all these sculptures that are behind me are all from the Soviet era and they were dedicated to the workers, the laborers of the city. But now, pretty much abandoned and not well taken care of, probably because you know, modern day Georgians don't really have as good an image of the Soviet Union as, you know, the people who are 70, 80 years old now, who lived in that time. They have much more of a nostalgia for the whole thing. Without a doubt, my favorite one, though, is this one, which I will coin Stairway to Heaven. Блин, целая курица. Она живая? Да. Вот ее так покупать. Я купил, я. Здесь можно купить, блин, живую курицу. Да. Okay, I'll be honest. That is not something that I have seen in any market before in my entire life. A live chicken being put into a bag and sold. That's not Coca-Cola. Oh Это не Кока-Кола. Ну, понятно. Georgians are very serious people. I've been told once you get to know them, they're going to be like your best friends, but until then. And Georgia is a really cheap country in general, but especially now that we're outside of Tbilisi, it's dirt cheap. So, for example, this, it's sort of a calzone looking thing with some rice and the uh, like sausages inside this thing costs i just said that in a really weird way that thing costs one lati that's like 35 cents not a bad country to be like a broke american in 